Thanks, guys. We're looking forward to playing another NCAA tournament this weekend. Um, you know, proud and happy we're being able to host. Proud we're, we're the 16th seed um, in the tournament. Um, you know, I think our players are feeling pretty confident right now, feel good about what we've done the last few weeks. Um, but we can throw all that out the window. And when the tournament comes around, it's, it's time to see who executes. And, and uh, like Coach Cal said, who has the most fun and, and uh, who competes the hardest to be able to win each and every match out. And uh, there are six total matches you can play. And, and we have to focus on East Tennessee on Friday night and you know, hopefully successful. And, and uh, if we are, get a chance to play the winner Notre Dame and, and Ohio State. Also pretty you know, proud of our team and the conference awards we won. You know, having uh, you know, our libero being defensive player of the year in the league for the third straight year is unprecedented, I think, probably in about any sport. Um, another first team all league player in Whitney Billings and, and Cleefoot second team also. Sarah Schwartzwalder first or uh, all freshman team. I think with the addition of teams in the league, I think there's a lot of players that were left out uh, across the league and, and we try to get more not a recognition for some of the players in this conference, but uh, um, it's just the way it is. But again, proud about the weekend, looking forward to it, and uh, can't wait to see if we can uh, get a huge crowd on Friday night. Carl, you think your regular season schedule did a good job of preparing the team for the, uh, the tournament coming up? Well, we're definitely battle tested. We've seen about everything. We've seen top five teams. We've seen um, SEC caliber teams. We've won in five. We've lost in five. We've won in three, lost in three. I mean, there's not a uh, an event or situation we haven't been in. So I'd like to think that any any situation we get into Friday night, we've been there before and, and understand how to handle it. But um, I think so. But, you know, each rally is, is pretty significant and pretty important. And, and, you know, I'm looking forward to see how our team responds to it. How do you feel like you're playing right now going tournament? Well, we were, we were awfully good our last three matches. And, you know, especially being on the road around Thanksgiving, a lot of distractions with the holiday and, and uh, family and stuff around and, and we came off a couple losses and, and strung together a few wins and you know I feel good about it. I feel good about our offense um, really like the way our team responded I think they feel confident about what they're doing right now and and that's a good sign going in the tournament um, but you know it's a different pressure in this daily tournament you see the logos you see the you know the brackets you see all kinds of teams getting jacked up to play in this daily tournament so um, we'll see but you know I like this team and, and want to be with them heading into it what are some of the things you think you're doing well right now, and what are some of the areas you guys can improve? Uh, well, offensively, our efficiency is pretty good. We aren't making a whole lot of errors. Um, uh, our floor defense has gotten better. We were, we struggled with that in the middle of the year, playing against some good teams with good outside hitters. Um, and I think we've uh, done a good job of that the last few weeks, and, and that is very important because that's typically where matches are won and lost in the tournament with big outside hitters. and. Uh, I think we're serving pretty well, and, that, and that's another major factor in the NCAA tournament. Can you serve and get teams out of systems so they can't set all their options? What kind of crowd are you having for this weekend? Eight thousand. <laughs> no, I, I mean, I, you know, I don't know. I, I think we got a good response already, and and uh, last year, you know, in the regional there was over four thousand, and um, somewhere in between that, and you know, our average attendance is fifteenth in the country, between fifteen hundred and two thousand a match, and. Um, you know, I, I think we'll get a good crowd. The volley, volleyball community here is, is really stepping up.